All right, so this is how Coffee Maker works. So we first got uh, the reservoir of water that's filled uh, up on the sides. So the water then descends through a little hole into the base and then it travels all the way up into or on top of where the actual coffee grounds are. So what happens is there's actually a coil that surrounds the, the, the metal tubing that the water flows through that heats up the metal. In turn, it heats up the water, and what actually happens is that steam is produced, and steam is actually what travels up and down over the coffee grounds. Once there's enough uh, steam that is collected onto the coffee grounds, that's when the coffee drips into your mug or your cup. Now, for the mocha coffee process, it's sort of the same, but there is a key difference. Cool, so uh, there's actually a heating element at the bottom. This is where they get the heat. So there's a heating element at the bottom uh, that heats up the water that's at the base. Once the water is hot enough, there's a steam that produced and which goes into the coffee grounds right here. Now, once there's enough water uh, with the steam in the coffee, then the pressure uh, makes the water in the coffee flow up through the vessel here, this narrow, uh, this narrow tubing, and then that goes down and condenses into this uh, collection um, 